I have got to stop with the fucking wine tonight. It's the solstice, but oh my God, like I posted a, a, a video just previous to this, but I had come upstairs and I left it on pause. I forgot all about my good friend. Customer coming to purchase lip sense. That's what y'all for. I don't know who watches me on what. But I mean, I have lots of social media outlets and I try to categorize them to what pertains to what because I know I can be a lot for people and I'm not trying to be. I'm just trying to like resonate with someone, you know, like I just want to have a connection with um, a like-minded individual, you know. So, um, when that does not happen on a 3D level, I feel like making a video, um, YouTube, you know, uh, when I want to get down from the, all that high up thingy, because I really have an expanded intelligence and is like so far up in the fucking 13th dimension. Sometimes I really need to pull myself fucking back down from the fucking sky because I've almost like ascended twice you know and I really actually like both times I almost did it I was really hoping I would have achieved it and then it was like the same kid that pulled me back like a snapback rubber band down to the depths of hell This is a lipstick video, though. That's what I was saying. Like, sometimes I, this, like, I love glam. Who's this? Oh, hello. Hello, cute kitties. I love my cute kitties. Anyways, my friend that came over to buy lips, I haven't put my lipstick on all day. I, I, this sounds silly. And this is another reason why I love my divine masculine. Um, <laughs> every little tiny thing it to me is so fucking, it's always so fucking meaningful. That's the thing. And it's like, oh my God, what color do I wear? You know, like I just, it's an intricate thing. Like, I don't know. I don't want to use my brain. Like I miss somebody like actually caring about what I want to maybe be representing of and sometimes I'll sit here and I'll be like I can't figure out a lipstick because there's a different me that wears my black lipstick that I think is my favorite and then there's a different me who likes purple and then there's a different me who like might want a different color so it's like I just when I have so many facets and like little intricacies to my own existence, it is like really hard for me to make decisions in this third dimensional world. And it just is like, I am, um, I'm just w anchored way too deep and way too high infinitely to be like muddled up in all this shit. So it's like, I really enjoy having a, um, you know, a best friend who, like, wants to uh, suggest or have fun mixing different makeup colors, you know, it's like it kind of takes a lot of the um, intense pressure off. So, basically, I'm making a video about this goddess lip sense right now. So, maybe I'll timestamp cut to the chase, right? Goddess lip sense. All right, there's a cute story about this, though. And that's why I decided I was going to tell a story about it because my friend that came over wanted goddess lip scents. And I'm going to put mine on. And then after I have it on, I am going to tell the story about it. So here's an application demonstration. You know what, I probably have gloss on my lips. That's probably not good. You are supposed to start off with clean, dry lips. Okay. 
I just want to tell the story of this color. I the the story of this color is awesome. Oh. Hello, Snazzy. Hold on, I'm just gonna <laughs> uh. Okay. Sorry, that was like I was like, oh did I hit the the button? <laughs> Sorry, I didn't hear that song. Juicy cherry lolly. Um, pink strawberry. I like pink strawberry. All right, cool. So goddess and pink strawberry. Love ya.